It was 7pm when the first call came in. Dad, come and get us. We're on the side of the road somewhere. Car's broken down. Along the highway somewhere. We don't know exactly where. The call only lasted 30 seconds. But in that short time, their daughter Kylie was able to tell him that her car had broken down about 40 kilometres north of Goulburn. I said, can you call in RMA? And she said, no. She had probably 20 seconds worth of coverage on her phone. With Kylie, on that cold, dark, miserable night, was her 18-month-old daughter. The major concern was Kylie and Sarah's welfare. That was, that was all that was paramount to us. With 140 kilometres between his Canberra home and the stricken car, Michael and his wife began the long drive north to look for her. It was just knowing where to, where to find them. Yeah, but it's not real good for, you know, for a young mum and, and bub to be sitting along the side of the road sort of waiting and wondering what was going on. They were five minutes outside Goulburn when the second call came. This time, his daughter was phoning from the cab of an NRMA tow truck using the driver's mobile. Well, I was on my way out of Goulburn to do an NRMA job. When I pulled up behind the car, I realised it was actually the wrong car. And then I realised the young lady had had her daughter with her. I said, look, I can't leave you here, it's too cold. Have you got anyone coming to get you? And she said, I'd rung Dad, but he really doesn't know where I am. The phone went flat. I said, well, I'll give you a lift into Garvin, and you can ring him on the way and tell him where you're going to. For Kylie, the ordeal was over. Very relieved and very happy that he had the nice big deal cab and we were all able to fit in the back of it. Because that's what I was worried about, was that um, Sarah wouldn't be able to fit in and we'd have to wait anyways for Dad to come and pick us up. It was a great service that the guys provided. It lets the members know that there's people out there that do actually care, which is really important. It's been said that when you're stranded by the side of the road, being with the NRMA is like having a thousand dads out looking for you. Michael is one dad who's proof that that old adage has never been truer.